Hi. Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss the topic is how can we use field set on visual force page. Before we are going to discuss the same, let's get into field set. What is field set basically? Field set is a grouping of fields and field set can be created by admin and it can have multiple fields and <clears throat> how can we include field set on a visible force page see here by using a global variable object type after that object name where we create field set and field sets dot field set name and what are the considerations we have what are all the considerations we have for field set you can have up to 50 field sets referenced on a single page. A Salesforce org can have up to 500 field sets. Okay, so how can we display selected records from a list view? So whenever you want to display selected records from a list view, you just need to use selected property in the page block table. Then automatically it can get the selected records through this record set where property okay so let's see how can we do the same example with and without field set then you can see the difference between field set I mean with field set and without field set what is the advantage of field set let's create a visual force page without field set so now I'm creating a visual force page Mm -hmm. display selected records and account <coughs> record set where account list As I said, to display the selected records, you just need to the use you just need to use the property standard property that is selected. Where is it? In column header value equals name. value equals okay same way I want to display industry also So as a developer, I have implemented a visual force page which can be displayed selected records on this visual force page from list view. So to do the <coughs> to display selected records from list view, first of all, you have to create a list button. Let's create a list button. So let's go to this. So on account object, I clicked on buttons and links and actions then selected records so I am selecting list button display existing visual force page account records list display no 
this is not our page selected records <coughs> list button visible force display selected records done now to add okay, selected account records to add this button to the list view you have to use such layouts here click on this here if you see list view click on edit and here you can see selected account records this is our list button save done now let's go to list view so for now we don't have anything i'm refreshing this So nothing is there because I didn't select anything. Now let's go back. Let me select. Edge communications. Okay. Alpha dynamic. And we have Burlington textiles and edge communications and four accounts. I selected. Just click on selected account. See here. I got four accounts which are selected because of selected property now yes with this we are able to display selected records successfully on page block table so after few days so business wants to display one more column that is type column from account so to do that again developer has to be involved to do that change in the visual force page admin can't do the code right so now how can i add type here so developer has to come to this visual force page and he has to add like this So with this, what we can realize that for any such kind of change for adding or removing the columns, admin or Salesforce admin has to depend on developer, right? So let's see the change, whether it is reflected or not. See here, it reflected and type column is added now how can we do the same thing by using the field set right now what we realized so for removing or adding a column developer has to change the code admin can't do because admin don't know coding right now let's go with the field set so where you can create a field set on object level now we are talking about account records right that means we have to create field set on accounts only account object so here if you see on object level you have field sets click on that and I already have one field set I am going to create one more field set account records field set so here you can give any description which is meaningful this will be used for displaying the account records Done. 
now account name account number if you want type industry phone okay so what i did now i just added fields okay under available for field set so to display this fields or to display this fields data on visual force page or in any apex programming you have to make it available in the in the field set box okay so here drag and drop okay and okay phone industry and if you see here whenever you use this field set on visual for space it follows the same sequence first column will be account name second column will be type and third column will be industry and for now i am removing this to this from in the field set box that is phone now it will display account name type and industry if you use this field set on your visual force page so let me take this now same visual force page i am going to change it so let me remove this i just commented so if you see here nothing will happen so no table here now so i think i can save this yeah now it is saved let me refresh now so no data no table now i am going to use field set instead of giving columns individually see here i'm going to generate columns also through field set so let me take same code here okay now we have to go through all fields in the field set for that i am going to you i am using repeat you have to use repeat for going through each and every field from the field set value equals as i said you have to use object type okay let's take this what is the syntax for this object type that where we written where we created this field set account object dot field sets standard that what is the field set name let's go to our field set name this is field set api that now where okay now now let's generate columns for every field a column will be generated so header value equals field dot label okay that is for label and value equals field dot value just need to use this you have to generate data from that field right for every field so this is how you have to use here what you are doing you are using the same instance 
okay however you are using for base block table previously which we implemented and you are including this field this is the var attribute value here in the repeat for account records field set and you are including this field value or uh, var attribute value in act obj instance open square bracket close square bracket in between you are including here then it will extract the data from field okay here what we are doing for every record okay for every selected account record it is looping through all fields which are given in the field set so in our case field set is account records field set okay and we are generating columns here so now deploy this let's see the change see here if you see account name account type industry as i said it came in the same sequence now as i am using field set as a developer now if business comes i don't want this industry i want to display another field like phone so then admin don't need to consult developer he can go to field set here and he can remove industry and okay he can remove field industry and save so now if you see account name type phone i don't have industry in the in the field set box done let's see so industry should be removed and phone number came this is how field set will be useful for admin that's why wherever we have the possibility to add or remove in future okay in the pay in the visual force page then you have to use the field set field set will be very useful for adding or removing columns on visual force page by admin without involvement of developer okay this is the biggest difference when you use field set and when you are not using field set for displaying the records on visual force page okay this will be applicable for apex classes also when you are using any field set in the apex class also it is applicable there but when you use field set you have to use wherever it is applicable wherever it will be useful okay wherever it can be removed by the administrator then only use field set you should not give this option for every functionality okay so this is about field set so in this video this are the references in this video what we learned we learned what is field set how can you use field set on the visual force page or how can you refer field set on visual force page how can you display selected records from a list view and what is the difference between if you display selected records on a visual force page without using field set and with using with fields field set what is the difference also you saw that so please go through this reference for more information you can go through that please subscribe to salesforce tech book all the best